Stand by. Ooh. Press checks are free, folks. Now we're good to go. What's up guys? Damon Ortega here with Triarm Defense. Today we're going to be running the Modern Samurai Project uh, Black Belt Standards Drill. I'm taking his course in January of 2024 and I'm hoping I can work up to it so I can pass the standards in his course. I believe at the end of his course, any student that wants to try it is allowed to try it, but you have to pass it in his course consecutively from one first iteration to the last iteration to get your patch from Scott. Today I am going to be running this drill out of a Axis Elite holster with a Glock 45 from Langdon Tactical with Monsoon 7 uh, Lucky 7's porting. I do have a 507C uh, Hollow Sun and a TL01. Everything for this drill has to be done from concealment with a time standard for each portion. This is a very spicy drill. Uh, this is a very hard drill to complete and actually pass. I've seen a lot of guys, I've watched a lot of guys do this drill, and even some of the best shooters I know of have trouble passing this drill. Whether that be missing shots or maybe hitting shots and not getting it within the time standard that he's requiring. Um, so iterations goes like this. Our first iteration is going to be at three yards, which I'm standing at right now. You're going to fire three rounds to the center A box, those three boxes in the middle, three rounds there. You're going to transition two to the head box. You have to do that under two seconds. If you complete that, you're going to move back to the seven yard line, which I already have marked. You have to do one shot from concealment at seven yards to the center mass A box in under one second. If you complete that, you can move on from there, stay at the seven yards. Now you have to do a build drill, which is six shots to the center mass A box from concealment under two seconds. If you complete your build drill under two, under two seconds, you're gonna move from the seven yard line all the way back to the 25 yard line, and you're gonna fire one shot from concealment at 25 yards to the center mass A box under 1.5 seconds. If you complete all four of those iterations consecutively without fail, you receive your patch. I believe if you complete three of the four, he gives out this kind of make fun of you slash congratulations patch that you, you passed at least three of the four iterations. Uh, but we're not looking for the three quarter patch, we're looking for the full patch and uh, hopefully we can get it. But today I'm gonna be showing you me running the drill. You're gonna see the target, you're gonna see me the whole time, just so you can see where I'm at and I can see where I'm at. That way I can see what I need to improve on up until January when I take this course. Without further ado, we're gonna start at the three yard line and I'm gonna go ahead and get going. Press tracks are free, y'all. All right, first iteration, three yards, three shots to the A box, chest, transition, two to the head, under two seconds. Let's see how I do. Oh, I forget to mention, I believe, correct me if I'm wrong down in the comments, I believe if you fumble your draw, but you don't fire around, you're allowed a mulligan and you're allowed to re-go. But if you fire around, it's considered a fail. So if you fumble your draw, make sure you don't fire, reset, and go again. All right, three to the chest, two to the head, under two seconds from concealment. Stand by. All right, so that was clean, but I did it in a 218. So I think I need to speed uh, my first shot up, especially my first shot on the center mass. Uh, first three shots and I definitely need to speed up my transition from the chest to the head Otherwise, I feel like it was pretty good and let's go look at the rounds You see right here. There's three right here and we got one line right in the corner and then that one's good All right, so we did the three yards. Let's go ahead and move back to seven yards To do our one shot from concealment under One second, hopefully It's pretty spicy. We'll see what happens one shot from concealment, center mass, under one second. Stand by. Ah, not bad, not bad. I'm not too, I'm not too uh, unhappy with that. I did get a hit, it was 108, so just over the second. Let's go look at the round. 
There's your hit right there, that little guy. So I did get a hit, but I didn't meet the time standard and uh, you have to hit both, right? So let's go ahead and move on. Now that we did the one second, one round, let's go ahead and move on to our build drill. So build drill again, seven yards from concealment, six shots, center mass A box under two seconds. Let's see what happens. Stand by. All right, so that wasn't great. I knew I pulled one off to the left. It may have been two. Uh, we have to go look, but I definitely had a little bit of trigger freeze there. I don't know if you noticed it in the last couple of rounds. Um, so we got to clean that up some. Yeah, see, there he is. I threw one off to the left. Otherwise, uh, nope, sorry. I don't know what happened here. Let's, uh, let's, let's try not to look at that. Uh, so we did miss two. Again, bad grip, trigger freeze. Um, no excuses. We just fumbled it. Let's uh, move back. Let's move back to the 25 yard line. All right, you can see the target right there. And there you are, right there. All right, now this one, last one, one round from concealment to the center A box under 1.5 seconds. Let's see what happens. Stand by. Pulled that one to the left. Definitely fumbled my draw a little bit. I should have just reset and gone again. That's why he allows the mulligans. Um, but I went ahead and went for it. <sighs> Not supposed to do that. Hopefully we can correct that when the time comes. If you fumble your draw, make sure you take a second, reset, and go again instead of just go ahead and taking that shot. Yeah, so I definitely fumbled my draw, pulled it off, got into a rush, and threw it way left. Otherwise, I mean, that's just where I'm at. And that was in a 1.72. So that was the Modern Samurai Project Black Belt Standard Drill. Again, it's a very spicy drill, a very hard drill to uh, complete, both accuracy-wise and speed-wise. So it's definitely something you have to work into. I've seen a lot of uh, really good shooters shoot this drill and struggle with it. So I've got some work to do. Hopefully by January, we can work up to it and pass that drill in his course whenever uh, game time happens um, otherwise let me know how this video was go ahead and get yourself one of those modern samurai project black belt standards drills run it yourself let me know how you do in the comments don't forget to like subscribe and comment and uh i'll see you in the next one stay prepared stay safe